Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Tony, and we're here with uh, Lita. Hey girl. Hey girl. Hi. Woo. Yeah, I'm not gonna let her take the camera this time. So today I am gonna be doing the first half of the loop. The vortex, time machine, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. The idea is to go around like that. Boom. So I brought all this concrete over here and I've been getting busted bags of concrete so all of these are technically busted so instead of like five or four dollars a bag I get them for like two dollars or sometimes even a dollar a bag so right there you're looking at about twenty dollars worth of concrete and that should be enough to finish this and uh, yeah I got the concrete mixer so it shouldn't take too long I'm out here by myself right now but I don't really care because uh, like I said Creative minds don't wait, we create. Uh, it's been a while since my last uh, video I posted. So let me show y'all how a few things went out. The coping, it came out perfect, if you can see. No movements, the ramps, it came out pretty good. Uh, got all this stuff did. I actually used a pull trial coping, a pull coping trial for this one. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, she, she has to always be in the video. We've been working on this for a minute, so check this out. Stay. Stay. Okay, go, go, go. That's my baby girl. Hi. All right, all right, now let's go build a skate park. All right, that might be better. All right, one, two, three, action. All right, back to work. So we used that much concrete, like maybe half. And this is what we got so far. I've been putting about like three bags in this thing. And it takes like maybe two minutes to do three bags. So I've probably been working for like 30 minutes. And it'll probably take me 30 more minutes to do the rest of that. I know y'all ain't trying to see the whole work progress. So I ain't really trying to do that. I could do a time lapse, but basically it'd be like this. But that's basically what it would be like. So I'm not gonna do all that. I'll just kind of show y'all guys the what I got whenever I'm done. Alright. Whoa, whoa. So that's what it looks like. Thanks, Brian. He killed it. He came through today and helped me do this. So it made it a lot easier. I didn't have enough concrete to finish, so I tried to stop it as close as I could to right there. I mean, if y'all wanna see like how I actually do the concrete part let me know and I'll show y'all but that's kind of boring but uh, yeah that's what's going on there it is man so I know I probably skipped a few steps like the spot that we well I missed I put some uh I just put another like four bags there and it ended up working perfect this part on the loop it's actually been kind of tricky kind of been you know I'm on so I haven't really been filming too much on it, but it's basically just bending the wood the best way you can. Uh, that piece, it was really hard to connect, so I basically just left the piece open right there, and then I had a big piece of cardboard, and yeah, I just drew a, drew a piece out. Uh, yeah, right now I'm actually building the frames to put in here. Man, I hit my hand on a nail yesterday, right here, you see that? I was wedging this in there, and I go, bam, right in there. Kind of, kind of delicate spot, but uh, yeah. So I'm getting these wood, like this old wood that I recycled from an old job I did. They let me have it, so I'm gonna take out the nails right now and just start putting up a, a support system the best way I can. So there it is. That's how that's how I started my loop. Um, I guess uh, I don't know. I'll show y'all the other video whenever I start finishing it. But uh, y'all got any questions, man? Just let me know. But uh, that's what's going on right now. Y'all guys have a good day. I'm Tony. This is my backyard. 
And yeah, come skate if y'all want to. Peace.